Hi everyone, welcome to the Let's Talk Mommy show. Today I have something very exciting to share with you. I know it's been a while since I last vlogged and I apologize for that. Uh, life has just been really busy. Now I am no beauty blogger, but I am female and I do like to look my best. And today I have a little secret to share with you that I have found as wonders in the beauty department. So I'm blonde, I am always envious of the long beautiful eyelashes that brunettes have and it just looks so much better and it makes your eyes pop and it doesn't give you that tired look and because I'm blonde and I have short eyelashes I always look tired no matter how much mascara I put on and I have tried the false eyelashes and the extensions now I don't want to keep making appointments I have two small children I don't have time to keep getting my eyelashes filled or have time to get um, fake ones put on because I'm never good at putting them on they're always popping up on the corners or coming out and inside and always having to reapply the glue and I get it all over and it's just like a beauty catastrophe basically for me. Now I was recommended this amazing mascara, fiber mascara called Unique by a lovely friend of mine and it has literally blown me away. At first I was a bit skeptical but I'll show you what I mean in a minute. Um, it basically gives you the extension of the eyelashes, gives you the thickness you want, it's something you can do yourself, so easy and quick, every day or just on a night out. Um, and for me, I was going to do a before and after photo to show you the difference between regular mascara and the unique fiber mascara. But a lot of people on Twitter were saying some of the photos looked like they were showed photoshopped or fake eyelashes and it didn't look real. So I thought I'm going to do a vlog about it and show you me putting it on and that's as real as it can get and you can, be dis um, and you can decide which is better. Now today I have all my makeup on that I normally wear and my normal mascara. So this is what my, if I went out um, on a night out or even had like a lunch date during the week, um, I would put my makeup like this with my mas regular mascara. And for me, I don't think, I can zoom in a little bit, I don't think it does much definition or shows my eyelashes very much. They're short and no matter how many layers of mascara I have, it doesn't pop those eyes and today I'm going to leave this one normal so that you have a comparison and I'm going to put the unique mascara on my right eye which would be your left sorry and um, show you the difference so I'm going to go ahead and get started you will get your unique pack and it has two tubes in it one is your fibers and one is your gel and it's nice because this little pack you can use for anything. You can put little brushes in it, you can put other makeup in it, and it's a nice little hard traveling case. So it can be used for lots of different things, so it's a bonus. Now, one, the small tube is your fibers, and the tall tube is your gel. And what you can do, and you can just put it over your regular mascara. Um, some people prefer to put a thin layer of mascara on anyway. Um, and then you start with the gel, the biggest tube. I do this little handy trick where I unscrew both and just have them easily accessible and I keep them like that so that I can apply the gel and apply the fibers and apply the gel over top of the fibers to close it all together. So we're going to start with my gel and like I said I'm going to just do this right eye and excuse me if I'm looking funny in the mirror, we always do. And I'll just apply a thick coat of the gel, move my hair out of the way. And you can see already that it is extending my eyelashes. So I like to really get them in the corner. It's going on my eyelid just a little bit, but that's okay. We can wipe that off later. Now you can see that I put the gel in quickly. That's why I have it open and ready. Before it dries, I just extend it with the nice long fibers. Like so. And like I said, if it just gets a little bit before it dries, you can just wipe the gel off your eyes. Now, I've never had this problem where my eyelashes touch my eyelid until I've used this mascara, so that's a good sign. And already you can see, we'll touch it up later. And already you can see the massive difference between this eye and this eye. Now, after you put the fibers on, you just need to put another little coat of gel over top so it kind of seals it. 
And note to self, never do curly hair first because it gets in the way. So we're just gonna add another layer. Now I know that I have a little bit on my lids so I can just touch up my makeup after, but it gives out that extra little oomph. I don't have many lashes to hold on to, so as you can see, it's done. It's fair job. Now a lot of people only like it on the top or like it on the bottom. I'll put it on the bottom just so you can see the difference, but I usually only wear it on the top of my eyelids. But just so you can see the overall, this is where the face is always going now. Faces always go a little bit funny. Because who can do mascara without opening your mouth? Now I did get it on the bottom again. I'm a bit messy with this. Too much coffee and got the shake, so... Not a good combo. <laughs> and I'll just wipe it off with my little Q-tip. And spread it out just a little bit. And add the layer of gel. Because I put my... So it's gel, fiber gel, gel, fiber gel. And you can keep layering it if you want it really thick. You want it really um, to shine for a night out. This is just during the day, so we're just gonna seal it a little bit. Spread them out a little bit there. And I'll just wipe the bits so that I can still see. Sticking out. Now I've only done one little tiny layer of Unique Fiber Mascara on this side, and this is my regular mascara. Now, like as I said before, you can layer it um, over top, so you do another coat of gel, another coat of fiber, and another coat of gel, um, and just keep repeating it to get the thickness and the look that you want. I like it to be more, a little bit more natural for my day look, so I only ever do one little side, um, and I think it's, it's a big difference. Um, when I back up, you can see my eyelashes still. Um, it helps in photography when you get your photo taken for your eyelashes to actually show up. And for those tired moms like me, I love it because it makes me feel like my eyes don't look sleepy and I look um, a bit more fresh and awake. And it really just makes me feel a little bit more confident about myself. Now, I've been raving about this mascara and I've been using it for a few months now and I'm absolutely loving it. Um, and I'm really excited because I'm not only sharing you my exciting news about it, but I'm also hosting a giveaway on my blog. Uh, if you go to www.letstalkmommy.com, click giveaways and get your entries in. And you too can stop wearing those false eyelashes and stop booking in for those eyelash uh, refills and get the look that you want. Now, so you can see it's not photoshopped and this is how I get my long um, dark eyelashes. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.